two, one, welcome to the box, Celia, Eric, and we had three intermediate moves, half tennis of flan, nine variation. We started tonight again with right hand, two right hand moves the whole night. We started with a nice step back, a bit more like a Latin turn. I tend to show my hand relatively early, I'm gonna bring Celia forward, and do a very slight prep once she's transferred her weight, so that she's not turning in a rotation, but stepping and having this little bit of rotation, catching my hand because magically she saw my hand ready for her. And I'm gonna do a return. Why am I doing this? Two reasons. First, so that I can have my right hand under and left hand above. And second, so that I can open outside of the track. So that Celia has a nice track number two and on track number one. I'm gonna bring Celia forward. My right hand goes to my way hip, my left hand goes high up, a bit like a flamenco position, hopefully. And I'm gonna let Celia continue walking past me. I can accompany her a little bit with my right hand here, but I let her go around. No tension on the right, I mean a little bit of tension up, but no tension to make her turn. She's turning on her own. When she's facing me, I just accompany her, catch with two hands, and you return. Okay. Ladies, when you're going around, you can take your time, you can take your style, you can do plenty of fancy things, you can do things like that if you want, as long as you keep just your attention, it's all good. Second move. Kong. The multiple Kong. The recurring Kong. We did exit with two hands, and then you return. And then a little bit of tension out, in, offering my hand low, out, in, offering my hand low, out. We also talked about not creating tension, just doing the comb on the spot, or I can comb myself if I want to, or I can do alternate. A little bit of tension out, and we have another comb fancy variation. Oh, oh yes, a fancy move for tonight. Return, comb myself, this time I'm not trying to bring her, uh, Zida's hand across, I'm keeping her hand on the shoulder, letting it, it go straight away, bringing my hand on Celia's shoulder. Actually, I'm slightly behind her neck and not so much on the shoulder, right here. Now what I'm gonna do, leader, important your knees, I'm gonna go low and go with the head under like that. And as soon as I do this, notice the hand of Celia. Now the funny thing is I'm gonna be doing the same thing with my right hand here, a little bit of tension, and we are out like this. And from here, I'm just gonna have an intention forward to create the tension here in the arm, and that's enough for the step back. I'm actually not pushing, it's not from the hand, it's from here. Push again, here, that's enough. I wanted to walk forward and then I walk back, actually. Get to the right, and what do we do next? We are actually prepared for the flamenco again. 